to all the role players, the Brotherhood of Freedom, Belka Ben, Chiron, Neo, Alanis, the Bugsy Council, Wolf Third Cross, Unity, and all the role players. I'm glad to be back in the Zeta Omniverse with all of you. I'm so glad to have all of you as our friends and Nova and Perium will ensure our objective to not only bring the presence of the Zeta Empire back to the Zeta Omniverse, but to also repair our relationships and restore peace. The Brotherhood has sent us their articles for the Brotherhood Peace Treaty and we will begin to discuss the treaty. Article 1. Reparations are to be paid to the Belkin Federation for attacking them and harming the President's nephew. I'm not sure if the Empire will do this themselves, but Nova Imperium will be more than happy to do so ourselves. As we speak we are sending large number of our resources and credits to the Belka Federation. Article 2. The immediate denouncement of the Del Sol Valley Empire for crimes of murder and deception. Oh shit. I mean, oh fuck, this one? This one is a very difficult one. I know the Saint Empire will not agree to this, and I'm not even sure we can even speak on this matter. As I said, my friends, this one is difficult. However, with Article 3, the full recognition of the new Zeta Republic, which is a nation of survivors from Zeta's aggressive attack in respect of their sovereignty. We of Nova Imperium fully recognize the new Zeta Republic and will not only respect their sovereignty but also guarantee their independence. Article 4, agreement there, there will be no more alternative versions of the role players and no more depictions of them being defeated or being used as scapegoats. This one is easy and can be ensured immediately. Article 5, there is to be no more sequel section of our inappropriate pictures of our girlfriends and loved ones in future videos. And the final victory video is to be enlisted. This will be done and you can ensure that no more harm will come to your girlfriends and that video will be enlisted. That brings an end to the peace treaty. We can ensure all but one article. I do hope with this we can finally begin to repair our relationships, my friend. Now, Astrid, I need to ask you. Who are those who attacked us and tried to stop us? And what about all of this information the Brotherhood of Freedom has sent us about you? The ones who were after us were the Alliance Federation. Remnants of the Alliance Defense Force seeking to protect the role players and ensure their increase of power and control. And it seems I can no longer hide this any longer. I was a part of the Brotherhood of Freedom but I had since left it with a few others loyal to me as we have come to a strong disagreement with the Grand Master. We have come to disagree with their ideals of truth and justice as in this existence such things can never ensure victory or peace. Things must be done by any matters with force and death. One must be willing to commit to the darkness to ensure victory and death of our enemies had the Grand Master done so none of these threats would have been able to survive. But because of his foolish belief in truth and justice and other worthless shit and not using the full power of the Brotherhood it had allowed Sage and others to gain victory over us. That is why I and others have left to from the Dark Brotherhood and to recruit more to our cause I have declared myself as the true Grand Master and we will ensure the death of Sage and all our enemies for revenge. The Brotherhood will be purge of weakness and all threats eliminated until total victory and power belongs to us. That includes killing all you Imperials. HOLY FUCKING SHIT!